everybody, it's Vampire Chicken, a Grandmaster at the Game of Risk, playing one of the most fun maps that uh, I haven't featured here on the channel in quite a while. So let's get ready to triangulate today, because we're playing on Trigon's Labyrinth. We are doing progressive capitals in the fog and with the blizzards, and this is a really cool, awesome map. And the thing about it is the blizzards. So look at this. These blizzards make like a one-point hold on like this entire left side, which also means this is some sort of one-point hold on a giant amount. The, this blocks things up and this blocks things up. There's going to be a giant fight in there. And then red is dead in the center. So to go, if anyone wins the left, they're going right through him. I, so I'm going to go on the right, I suppose. I don't have too much material. My material is mostly in the center, which is not necessarily where you want it to be. Uh, is this my best? Is, can I do anything better than this? I mean, this is like, you know, the noob corner. It's a plus four, so someone's going to fight me. But surely the left is where all the action is. Like, for sure, right? Let me double check a few things. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'm going dead in the center of the soul stone. So anybody over here will know that I'm over here. And it's very likely that people have capped around me and they now know that I'm in here and I do not know that they're lurking. So I think this will be a dangerous cap, but certainly a fun one. Aha, so orange goes behind me over there. We have at least one enemy. Orange doesn't know that I'm in here, but he might learn one day. And we'll see how this goes. So get ready. If you've never seen it, this is one of the wildest maps. I would uh, not recommend it if your only goal is to maximize your rating. But you can do very well on it. Uh, you can be successful as a strong player, and you could rank up. You could probably get the Grandmaster playing something like this, but it would just be a little bit more difficult because this is most often thought of as a highly snowball kind of map. If I can dominate the entire right side, blast through Red's cap, win the left side, okay, that's how we play like a glorious snowball. But usually there's a couple people trying to get in your way, and you got to get through those people, and you got to dominate the entire world. And here's who we're doing with it today. General Winkle has pink and we don't know where they are and <laughs> red does not add to the capital very curious general wild is in the middle if somebody wants your cap like i don't know man i get a lot of troops you know i got a three here i'm, I'm just saying Fazman has green but red going to the left is good everything is going to be on the left my goal is to destroy orange and to do that i need this triangle of glory and goodness. So please tell me it's it's not there's not another person. I can see three caps, they're all on my side here. General Rock, please tell me you're a left sider as well. I don't want to have to wrestle Dwayne the Rock Johnson today, okay? I just want a simple snowbally victory, okay? That's just how I like it. Okay. So he's somewhere. God, I wonder if there's something here. So I think we first peek here cuz that'll tell me if there's like a cap. Like did somebody just go right here in my face? Like, is it black? Does he see me? They're doing a lot. A lot means left side in my mind. There's no reason to attack five or six territories that I don't see on the right. A lot of attacking means you're over there. Orange, we know where you are. Okay. So first I'm going to hit this one. Weakly. <laughs> oh, don't let them know my true strength. Then I'm going to hit you weakly. And by weakly, I mean I'm only using two troops because I'm trying to preserve. Now, I suspect... The black is on the other side, highly. Do not know where pink is. Okay, but I can tell you where they're not. They're not on my side. Let me clear this out a little bit. Okay, now we need to conserve troops because we are fighting against orange primarily. So orange is our biggest competition, San Su. Now, fortunately, orange has not seen us, so they do not know that we have this bonus. But this is plus four troops. If we can defend this, and it is a four-point hold for a plus four, but if we can somehow manage to defend this all, then we will be able to defeat orange easily. And orange has a split bonus, and his cap here is going to be buried. This is actually very easy to destroy orange. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because he's going for... No, 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 it does go through. Never mind. It is not a split bonus. But orange does not have it. So I want to make a turn that orange doesn't see. What are you doing up here, Pink? Oh, Pink is a bot. Okay, so Pink, Pink couldn't make it. Pink has lost their cap. Probably to Black. Black was doing a ton. Okay, I bet Black has starts with seven troops. But they should be busy over on the left side. Or maybe it was red. Oh, red went this way because there was a cap. I understand. 
Okay, and now he's going to wipe out all of this. And red is going to be kind of kind of strong in the center, but we know there's going to be some opposition on the left. Aha, and he's trying to get this triangle immediately. Okay, sensible enough. So green is still over here somewhere. Probably not in orange's bonus. Probably not, but maybe. That'd be funny. The funniest thing I can do here is try to take the big triangle. This is the biggest bonus on the map. I mean, certainly orange is going to hit me. And it opens up orange's cap. It's bad for a lot of reasons, but it's funny. <laughs> so you got to weigh the pros and the cons. But I'm obviously trying to win this entire side. And I don't need to break orange yet. But it would mean hitting a lot that's not orange. My best strategy here is probably just to punch orange. Like, to smithereens, right? Just, just punch them as hard as possible. Come in here and remove all of orange. That way we can come in here and win this. But wouldn't it be funnier to make a really big triangle? Green is botting out. Okay, this is horrible. So the left siders are actually going to snowball very quickly. That's what this means. This is bad. Because it's just gonna be it's just gonna be red and, and the other guy. No, green is still here. Okay, that's good for us. We need more people to stay in the game. Because what happens is like, you know, one person takes a cap and then that person bots. Then you just easily defeat the bot and you start snowballing. We gotta make sure that, that kind of stuff's not happening. Six for black. So black has a capital. They're doing stuff over here on the left side. We're not too surprised. Okay. We get removed from there. You're probably gonna remove orange as well. You're going to try to get this giant capital. I bet he's in like, the, oh no, maybe he has no cap but the void stone. Six could be no cap, but the plus three void stone. I would doubt it though. I bet he has a capital. Uh, funny or winning? Should we win the game now or be funny? By win the game, I mean, should we hit a bunch of this guy? Black is expanding rapidly. Holy smokes. Okay, so that's bad because he's probably not defending capitals. He does try to break me. Okay, we need to remove black anyway. Okay, this guy's this guy's a problem. Okay, so he's gonna come mess with me. He doesn't, you know. Don't you know that orange is behind me? I need to destroy orange, bro. Uh, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go funny mode. Okay, I'm a funny guy. People often say, "Bro, you're so funny," and I appreciate that. Well, why don't you guys laugh at this? I'm taking here. Yes, mine. And orange will know this, and I don't care. <laughs> the biggest triangle, baby. That's the way I like to play the game. Now, Orange cannot allow me to hold this, but he doesn't have their bonus yet. I don't think he's going to be strong enough to break into my triangle. And I don't think Black is going to try any shenanigans. Ah, so Orange takes this bonus and it leaves me alone. Oh my god. Yes, we're going to sneak it by. I don't think anybody's going to break me. Maybe Red will. Maybe Red will? It might be in Red's best interest in the middle. Because no matter what, I have to fight Orange. Like, I have to break orange. Orange just took all of this, and his cap is here. So we obviously have to fight orange. Ah, pink is going to break. Oh, but pink's a bot. Ah, the bot's going to break me. Oh, no. Oh, no. Is it going to double break me? Oh, please don't double break. <gasps> the bot double breaks me. Oh, no. Okay, we're going to have to do something insane. Oh, no. Okay, I'm about, to, I'm about to make the craziest play you've ever seen in the history of Risk. You guys ready? Red has that bonus. Okay, well played to them. Red has that bonus. And they're going for more bonus. Red wants even more bonus, but not yet. Okay. Green, how you doing? You hanging in there? Green is over here. Come on, you guys, there should be more... More pressure on black and red. You guys know red now is big and in the middle. And by big, I mean eight. Big. So big. But now, for the most insane play you've ever seen in your life. It's coming up, okay? Just wait. Six for black. So black's not actually, hasn't actually gained anything. I forgot pink was a bot. That's terrible. Okay. What are they going to come up with? So they should be fighting like green. And then red actually, like red is doing this well. If I had held all of this, I'd probably be strong enough to fight with red and orange at the same time. But I think red is, is keen on spreading to the left side. Just based on, he's got two, he's got an extra capital over there. He stole someone's cap over there, but I'm not sure. Here we go. Craziest thing you've ever seen. Not this. That's not the craziest thing. Yeah, I'm sure you've seen something like that before. Okay. Oh, get that three out of here. Boop. This is my, this is what I mean. I'm removing all of that. I guess I can go back to my cap. Okay, let's go back to a cap with three troops. Black might break me. I was going to full send and have nothing on my cap and assume nobody was going to see it. 
But what does Orange do now? Do they know that I have the giant triangle of doom? The soul halls? Do they know? I only have a three cap, but I don't I don't think anyone can mess with me. Even with like a trade-in, I don't think I can get messed with. So I think we're unless red, like I don't know, maybe red can mess with me. But red didn't see a lot of that nonsense. Orange is gonna bot out. Oh my god, if orange bots out, we just dominate this side. Okay, he didn't bot out. Why do you guys think for so long? <laughs> it's just weird. I just like have a plan. Let's just go smash this guy, and then I just go do it. Okay. Uh-oh, Orange does not break my bonuses. <laughs> oh no, he's, he's gonna be in for such a rude surprise. And uh, now we can see, people have two. Red has two. Pink bot is eliminatable somewhere. They're, they're no longer on this side of the board, so somebody will figure it out. Somebody will be able to kill Pink. I'm not sweating the trade-ins. What matters is the bonus. And I do have quite a bit of bonus. I should knock Red out of here. I should punch all of Orange out. I should make this a big number so Orange can't break me. I should break red. I should fight everybody. I should do everything. Yeah, red's not allowed this much bonus. No, no, no. That's too much bonus. We have to knock red out. Red's not allowed that much bonus. But red can also be somebody that's sneaking around. We don't want red sneaking around into our, our little territory here. We might consider buffing our cap on this turn. We might. But nothing's happening on the left. Somehow these guys are just canceling each other out. The longer that goes on, I mean, the better. As soon as somebody starts dominating the left, like the worst it's going to be for red, because red has to kind of pick a side and figure it out. But I'm going to start snowballing first. Green turns in early, so they're going to go mess with somebody, of course, which is fantastic. Okay, who knows what they're doing? Who knows? <clears throat> okay. I'm not seeing a lot of attack. He turned in, and then I'm like, I was just waiting to say something, but like there was no attacking. I was like, what? Okay, now he's attacking. People, there's a lot of deep thinking going on. Okay, people are going a little slow today. Doesn't mean they're they're bad at risk. It just means you know, there's a lot to think about. They're probably processing more information that you guys could could ever possibly fathom. Uh, another just six for black. Okay, it'd be really weird for him to mess with me because he's definitely got his own problems on the other side of the world. We know red doesn't have this bonus. So red just has two caps. Red has this bonus, but he doesn't have this guy. Okay, so this should be a pretty big number for me. You guys want to see a big number? I don't know how you guys feel about big numbers, but you're about to see one, okay? If you're scared of big numbers, look away. It's going to be like 20. <laughs> it's going to be a lot. Watch this. 20. 20 on the dot. Uh, you're just going to be a deterrent. You are going to be taking that. You must be a number that Orange won't want to hit, and you're going to try to remove all of Orange from here. Let's go. Get yourself removed. And you might be thinking to yourself, oh, that opens up his cap. Wait, I didn't realize that was going to open up his cap. Okay. Honestly, I had no idea that was going to open up his cap. Let's put those guys back on here. I think that's fine for now. I, I totally forgot that this connected. I thought I was just clear. I, I mentioned it earlier too, but it, it fooled even me. Even me got fooled. But okay, now we can see the yellow cap. And with 20 troops, we can probably yoink that on the next turn. Orange now might bot out for real. <laughs> for real, for real. And this is like, I'm still fragile for another turn. But once I get 20 again, and this cap is like super strong, and like I'm on lockdown, that's when we should be able to just kind of crush this game. So if somebody's going to break me, now's like your last chance. The first time you see like the 20 troops flashing, that's it. Because after this, if I dominate yellow, and I don't let red have a bonus... My next goal is to dominate everything and like win the red cap and then have half the map and just completely snowball this game out of control. And it looks like that's the direction we're headed. So my key so far to being successful was notice the giant honeypot, but then importantly, not have any troops over there. Because if I had even one troop anywhere, I almost certainly would have just randomly gone in there <laughs> and just put like the dumbest cap and I'd be in an epic fight. But because... The game knew, knows that I have this problem. It didn't uh, didn't tempt me, okay? My fate was not tempted. And uh, I had to pick a good capital, win my side of the board, and then probably just easily snowball this game from here. So get ready for it. We took the biggest bonus again. Kind of my goal on every map now these days is just find the biggest bonus and take it. But we have two bots now, and that's no problem at all. 
Uh, red turns in for eight. So red might be the one that interrupts me. They might. They might come down and interrupt me. Red knows enough, and they are stuck in the middle. Okay, so they have to go through my seven. Okay, well played. They use their turn in for this, though. And they don't even get to, to hold this. So that is completely fine. The bot is going to roll off this cap next, shutting off doors. Red doesn't know orange is down here. Red's going to feed me the orange kill here at some moments. It's a beautiful thing. But red is a strong player. Only a strong player would cap in the middle. But the middle on Trigons is very treacherous. Hopefully green's not butting out, but I think I think Mr. Fazman just needs a little extra time. He usually does to put a little extra Razuma Faz on top of his moves, okay? He's just like, oh man, where's the where's that little bit of Faz? I just need a little Faz. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, I guess Black already knew you were here. I thought he was revealing himself to Black, but Black already knew you were there. And these guys are over attacking every turn, and for some reason they're not getting they're not getting bonuses, they're not getting bigger. This is now a war between me and Red. And Red has already used his turn in. So we're not worried about him at all. We are gonna take care of Red. Dominate the middle, and everybody else is gonna keep fighting on the left. And this is gonna be glorious. Because black and green, these guys are not getting anything. They both just get like five, six. I mean, they're just hitting each other and they're really weak right now. That has to be what it is. Orange bot will roll off cap. What are the trades at? It's worth killing orange. Yeah, when I have four, if the bot ends on four, wait, we could just like win on the next turn almost. If orange bot turns in, okay, it's a little frustrating, but if orange bot ends on four, I mean, I'm turning in. Dead archery. I don't know where anything. Everything is a left card. Okay, we got a lot of left cards. No worry about that. Black is still attacking or what? I don't know. Like, what is with the time usage? <laughs> got one last attack in right at the last second. Well played. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't get to kill orange. Or do I? Oh, no. I actually don't get to kill orange. Or do I? I don't know. Maybe if that connects, we will. And this connects. I do want to kill Orange. Or do I? Wait, I actually don't. Or do I? Where is he? Okay, we'll take this back. Okay. Oops. Let's keep hitting this guy. That feels good. Green? I mean, you, you don't have to know about this side, okay? We're going to put three onto this cap. Seems fine to me. I don't think red is getting through it. Where is orange? Is he right up here? Where is orange? Is orange still on this side? I had no idea that he was on the left. Nobody cleared out the left side. So I guess orange is quite possibly over there. So this was just a super expensive turn. But we pick up a ghostly plateau and we're kind of a baller. We took back our plus nine and a plus seven. And red should not be strong enough. He can maybe break one bonus with good dice. I mean, unless his cap is open, maybe if he's super lucky, he can break this and then his cap is open to break us. And then they can break that. Theoretically, he can break all my bonuses, maybe, if the conditions are right. Now, everybody's super weak over there. I, do you think I have the weakest cap on the board right now? <laughs> I'm the strongest. Do you think I have the weakest cap? But no one's going to mess with it. Oh, he does get nine. He does get nine. Okay, well played. Well played on the nine. He's, he's done with me. He's not. He's going to focus other places. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Red had to fight with me. But now he, in his mind, he's like, I got to go dominate the left. But he doesn't have time. Maybe he can make some eliminations. But, like, you have to do everything right at exactly the right time to win from the middle. Like, if he just makes a bunch of eliminations and gets strong enough and then he can come mess with me. I mean, like, well played to Red. He, he actually could win this game. Otherwise, I mean, I'm, I'm about to have a couple a couple big turns here. How you doing, Green? Five troops. Beautiful. Keep up the good work. <laughs> I don't need to know what you guys are doing. I'm going to go find a bunch of weak camps at some point. Kills orange. Okay, fantastic. I'm happy Green got it and not red. Because I think now, I think, I assume Green and Black are fighting, even though we haven't seen anything. So if those guys just keep fighting, Red is going to get stuck in the middle. And Red used his turn to attack a lot, but he didn't, uh, didn't seem to do, he didn't seem to do very much. Now, the safest thing to do here would be to buff our caps, you know, just buff the capitals, not do anything insane, you know, strengthen our position before we go in for the kill. I think any sane person would do that if they were me. But Johnny Sanity has exited the building. 
Uh, I was waiting to see if this happened. Wow, green's going nuts. Wait, green is incredible. Okay, wait, green actually is super strong. Now I'm as far away from them as possible, which is fantastic. Okay, trades are getting big. Wait, we actually, we gotta be safe. Is he gonna keep going? Yes, he keeps going. That's crazy. Who are you hitting? Is it black or red? Who who might be weak here? I also would like to make some eliminations. Save a little bit for me, green. Okay. So green actually is probably massively strong. But like, what do you do if you're red? What if green has all of this and like I have all of this? Like, what do you do if you're red? Like, all right, good luck. Good game. Well played. Okay, black has bought it out of the game. Okay, awesome. Green is presumed to have a turn in. I do not. I think I need to go mess with green. Let's do it from here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're all shocked about how big I am. You should be shocked. Okay. Did that shock you? I'm trying to kill red. I don't know that I can, though. We gotta go break green. Oh, my God. We can't break green. Oh, my God. There's something in the way, and it's red. Oh, no. Red was in the way. Red was in the way. I couldn't I couldn't do it. I couldn't get through. So red is blocking me from getting to green. So green has to go through red to get me. Which way does he go? He's coming to me. Okay, he comes this way. Ah, shoot. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. I mean, you're going to die to green then. Okay, whatever. <laughs> He's going to break all my bonuses. You're going to feed black to green? What was that for? Okay. I mean, hitting my caps here just means you're giving up to green. Okay. You're going to take my three cap? So red is dead now, but he breaks all my bonuses, so now green should win. So green with the turn in just wins here. I don't have a trade in. Okay, so red... Oh, green doesn't have anything. Oh, wait, I misunderstood completely. Oh, green had nothing, but now he turns in. So he's about to have something. Because he got fed the black kill, but then he'll be very weak. I don't have a turn in yet, but I will very soon. Before red... Okay, we need to break red's bonus here. That's kind of important. Oh, wait, this is going to be a wild finish. I'm not going to defend my capitals. It's never been a part of my plan. You guys want to see something crazy? You've never seen something like this before. Green kills black ends on five cards. Or what? Because red did everything to attack me. Red, red just messed with me. I thought green was big as well. Green made all those eliminations, but didn't take any bonuses. They're doing it now. So now green is huge. Okay. So green is going to win on the next turn. They're going to get like 30 troops on the next turn. That's a lot. Maybe red is going to get the kill on black. Or black still has a capital. What are you guys attacking that you're not getting bonuses? Black bot turns in. Okay, that'll slow green down. Okay, if I can hold everything for one more turn, I'm going to win this game. Look, I just need to clear all this out. Hold my bonus one turn. I get a trade in before these guys. There's a bunch of black bot in the way. Oh my god, this it's, it's great. This is great. This is great. This is glorious. So there was another cap blocking me. There's another cap here that's blocking me from getting to green. I didn't want to hit red. I was trying to get two green. I had to go through red to get two green, but I think I, I might have made red a little bit angry. So angry that they're going to... I guess they have to hit me, but... I'm just saying. I'm just saying don't play the middle, dude. It's too tough. Uh, so we are doing this and this. We need to make sure we get this guy's bonus. Defending caps. Oh, no. I opened his cap. Is optional. As far as I'm concerned. Okay. Uh, well, maybe red's going to hit my seven here. <laughs> go for it, bro. Maybe he's going to hit my seven here. But we're going to have to go through red, and we're going to have a turn in, and he can't kill me, so we should be fine. I don't know if plus twos matter. Those are the same to me. Okay, come on. Let's see what he comes up with. Take a second card, bro. Go for it. And the problem is there's another red cap here. Green is going to be slowed down by black. We don't have to kill red on this turn. Getting this cap would be nice. But I think maybe red is going to bot out. Hmm... But also we one point hold. If we get the if we kill red. Hopefully it's not for one card. Hopefully it's for two. But if we can kill red, we one point hold everything and we win. Green has one turn. If we take this all of red and we take uh this capital, sorry, the one that's on heavy gate, green has one turn to break through me or it's over. Which would mean they would have to get through the bot in order to get there. 
So it's not happening on this turn. Red is botting out because the middle is too hard. General Wild, get back to the forest, bro. The jungle is calling. 15 for green. So green is getting big. I hate that it goes red and then green. Because I want to go open up the red cap so that I can steal the red cap. I have to kind of hope that green doesn't get a trade in. I, mean, I can try to kill red, but it seems silly. Okay, green's not... Uh, green's going to kill black, which will all but guarantee they get a trade in next. And then red's going to roll up all the caps. The problem is if I don't kill red, then green's going to get the kill for two. Uh, this is... Okay, but he doesn't kill black. Green is on the next turn going to get black and red. Unless somehow I can do it. I don't know that I... Even if I killed red and black, it wouldn't matter. And it would also be, like, not very possible. But maybe it's possible. Who knows? Mm, probably not. No, it doesn't even matter. Okay, whatever. Um, I assume we should defend our capitals. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We probably should. Okay. Let's decide what we want to do here. We're going to kill Rad. I, I, uh, it's a pretty bad roll. Ah, okay. I understand the situation. So we'll kill Rad. For not too much. And then give Green the chance to win this game. Okay, let's see if they can do it. Because they can kill Black, get a trade, and they should be able to win the game. They definitely can cap run. They don't even need to. They can cap run without killing Black. But they sh probably will kill Black first. But well played to them. Well played to Green. They did this well. Cap run? They're thinking... Okay, they're killing black. Are they cap running or not? Or am I just, am I blocked? But wait, but you're also blocked. Wait, I might get enough troops that they can't break through if they don't hit me. Are they gonna try to card block me? They're gonna kill black and try to card block me. But then you better get a trade in before me. I do have a trade in. Wait, oh my God, this is gonna be crazy. Oh, and they didn't kill black. That's nuts. So I don't get a card, or so they think. Wow. Okay, they're just, so they're, but I'm going to get a lot. I think I can get through that capital. I really do. Hang on. Green, green's trying to card block me, but I, ha I get enough, and I have a trade-in. This should be enough, or is it? It's probably not enough. Zero percent? Well, how about now? I lose 23? Oh, my God. Okay. Wait, so I lose. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Now they kill black and they end on five cards. Then I better be able to get through. I could have put these all here. Ah, why didn't I put these all here? I had, I could have put them all here. It's going to come down to some insane cap roll here. Okay, they're killing black. They're going to end on a bunch of cards. This is my last chance to get through before green gets to come through. And if they kill black, they end on five cards. But they're just farming the bot? That doesn't make sense. You kill the bot now. No, 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 no. This is very bad. They're going to do it on the next turn to guarantee a trade. No, this is fine. Unless I get through his cap. Then all, all bets are off. I should have pulled this 33 out, though, for this, this hit here. But I'm getting 60-something? It's not going to be 100%. It should be a decent chance. Hmm... This should be a decent chance. Not at all. Oh my god. Literally the exact same thing happened. Okay. <laughs> Literally the same thing happened. So now he's going to kill black and then easily go through me. Right? Oh my god. <laughs> Both of those rolls were such garbage. Oh, How does Kilted do it? I did the Kilted trick. I lost 23. And then this time, what was this other one? It was like the same. We just lost everything. We lost 27. This one was a little bit better. We took 17 off. Okay, please tell me you're killing black. If you're not killing black, I don't I don't know what to tell you. Letting black live with three cards was already risky. Now, do they go for the win now? Do they barrel through me and try to cap run? Or do they wait a turn? They're going to wait a turn, right? 
No, they're going to go for the cap run. But wait. Hang on. Okay, wait. Oh, he's going to get a trade in, though, before me. So he's not going for a cap run. Okay. No cap run in sight. How is green going to do this? They're going to end on four cards. So we need to put, like, everything on, on cap now. It's probably about time we defend it. So this is the one we need to defend more than this, because they're, they're coming out. They're so slow. Wait, this is why they didn't get a lot of troops. Oh, no, we're going to win. We're super lost. We're going to win easily. We're going to win easily. Is he going to get to the cap in time? Or is he just going to see it? He's going to get it. Ah, oh, he's going to get that capital. Wait, what does he have on this capital? Does he have anything on his capital? I can't remember what he did. Okay, he lets me hold this stuff. 26. Wait, did he keep anything on his capital? Okay. Okay. So he's slow. Let's just take... Ugh, a bunch of territory. Oh, we can't break things that way. Oops. We need more on cap. So he can obviously cap run because I'm going to weaken myself significantly. Oh, hello. Okay, that looks really funny. Uh, glad that happened. So now with a turn in, he easily cap runs, but maybe he's too slow to figure it out. He gets 15, turns in for 60. So he has this win. Can he figure it out? This will win. You go here, you split back, you take this, you come find this guy. Okay, that actually is enough, but he's not he's not going for the cap run. He's not he's not thinking. He's not thinking about the cap run at all. I only have one card. I have to survive long enough to make it another trade in order to beat this guy. Oh dear. <laughs> nice try on that three on three. Yeah, take it easy. Loses 25. So now he just needs to get this and then come find this. So he has this easily. He just doesn't know where the other cap is. Uh, green is good enough to beat me. Or are they? Yes, they are. Green is going to win the game. Wow! Well played to green. Yeah. Red slowed me down at just the right time. But, you know, he was in the middle, so he died. I have to imagine I had a better opportunity to stack up against the green cap. I could have done this better. I could have. Everybody was a master. Wait, there was two masters. Three masters. Oh, my God. But anyways, uh, it, was a, it was a good game. So we're going to throw it up on YouTube. I hope you liked it. If you did, please make sure you subscribe. And I'll see you guys for the next video.